Yo, what is up guys? Back from the video. So today we're gonna be talking about the new anime Vanguards update while I'm playing the game. So yeah, I might get a bit off track, but um yeah, let's get started in the video. Don't forget to drop a like and a sub and um Let's get in for real now. Alright, so as you can see on the screen right now, there is a screenshot of Anime Vanguards. Now, it's actually a JJK screenshot, but we actually have no JJK characters so far. Um, I think this could possibly mean that we'll have a JJK update soon. Maybe we can get um, characters such as Toto, maybe a clap ability that works like Law from Anime Ventures. You know, he takes the enemy units back to where they spawn from, or maybe like an ability. Kind of like um, a Rising Sludge move. I think there's endless possibilities with um, how Toto's clap ability could work. Now the next one is Yuji. I think Yuji could either have two Evos or maybe you could actually pick between these two Evos in the game. So first you would have regular Yuji, which is maybe mythic, legendary, I don't know. And then once you evolve him, he could turn into a secret or a mythic. One could be Sukuna, which is a burn and slow unit. And then you could have adult Yuji on the other side. Maybe he's like, you know, I don't know. Maybe he spams Black Flash or something. But yeah, I think it'd be really cool if we got a character with, you know, two options to pick for evolutions. And then maybe there could be like a soft lock on um, if you can evolve him again for the other evolution. The next unit we could possibly get is Gojo. It could either be similar to AAs or just any other games. Or it could have his own, you know, unique little style. Maybe before evolution, he'll use like hand-to-hand -hand combat. And then once you evolve him, he uses like red, blue, hollow purple, all the other stuff. And then maybe he has an ability where it freezes the enemies and then it one-shots the strongest enemy within that, you know, little domain. Next character we could possibly get is Yuta, which is a summon unit. He could work the same as um, Sajin Wu, except he's only summon or he could be like really weak and he can summon and then maybe they can take some inspiration off of anime adventures once again where um he has this ability if you pop it you spawn maharaga but then you also lose yuta and you can't spawn him again or place him down as a unit again. i think it'd be really cool if you just get like a really strong boss raid unit but then you also lose one of your own units i think my last speculation for this update is going to be nobara maybe nobara could be like a slow unit a support unit something that can center slow and for the rest of the characters they maybe they can be in like a part two of the update or maybe even a future update now before the update we actually had had two sneaks of two units uh we had as death um the other secret unit is this girl from fate i never really watched fate so i don't know what she really does let me go check that real quick all right so after looking at some of her stuff maybe she can be like a ranged unit or something uh i don't know maybe a support that can cause every single type of effect maybe it's like random one hit you get a stun one hit you get a burn and then with as death i think she could be a, like a really good support character where she has like this big range freeze and it's like for a decent amount of time but yeah i think they are gonna appear in the next update as um maybe secret units and then maybe fate can be another the update but i think as death is definitely gonna come as a mythic in the next update now for some juicy stuff we might possibly also have a one piece update um if you look in the screenshot right here i'll link the credits to the screenshot below in the description is by a guy named rexon but basically as you can see to i don't know why it's sasuke but to evolve sasuke you could use a double fruit he said he blurred out the name because they said something bad so let's just pretend it said something nice but yeah um with seeing double fruits inside of the you know evolution system we could for sure see an update for one piece within the near future maybe like maybe like nami as a farm and then luffy as um year five or something and yeah and our last piece of information today we have portals there might be a portal update soon i know in the screenshot it says double dungeon but maybe they could possibly reuse this um portal idea for portal updates inside of the game it could possibly even come for as death instead of this update you know and i think that's it for the video guys hope you guys enjoyed and i will see you guys in the next one peace